I they, they think did. Manson did a really, 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 really nice job. job. Yeah. Yep. If you see how the the team is organized, how structured they play, as if they know, I swim this way, like three, four meters, and I flick it to the inside, and then the other girl is coming. Come if they turn, they, they know I can flick it directly there because there's someone. Every everybody knows where they have to be and is reading the what game. To do. Yeah. There and we swimming. go again. Yeah. Thank you. And that's six. Six well, for GB. If, if there were two or three for Jean yeah. and zero for South Africa. If uh, the World Cup is going to be in Colombia, that's going to be a hard work for South Africa. There's still a lot for them to do. They've got a lot of good players. Yeah, so, but, but it, let, let, let it be an eye opener. Maybe they came here like, oh, we're going to fix it easily. And now they know, oh, we should train hard because Europe I, is not that easy. I don't think so. Because like uh, last May, uh, Otto was also in Holland. And he said that the, he liked our system. Like in Holland, we are choosing people in the latest and of most of the time who yep. are going to a tournament. So you have to be training, you have to stay fit. And like in South Africa, Las Interclubs, they already made a decision you were coming. And then after you don't, you lose the girls, you don't, because the distances are, are very big. And then people have to train, but if they don't do it, yeah, you don't see the front hand. So if now people had, didn't train, then yeah, on the tournaments you will see they are not fit enough. But now they're doing a good job. Yeah. That's six again, six again. Okay, six. Of course, not too long, I guess. If you are playing field hockey, just for the people who are watching this game, outside it's raining so hard. It's like a shower. Oh. Okay, there's a timeout for GB ladies. There's still four minutes, 46 seconds on the clock. I don't think Africa can do anything to get six points as well. It's six one now. They have to score five to become equal and to get, get an extra time. And how do they score five goals in uh, less than five minutes? That means uh, every every four of course, uh, every, every, every thirty seconds. Yeah. But if I, if I see the force of GB ladies, then no way. They they, they keep on swimming and swimming, and so they go around them. And they don't stop. It's really nice that they they now finally getting paid back because yeah. they've been working so long the GB. And yeah. And also the, in this team there are like Janet is, is, is one of all school girls who's been there for a long long time and every time with the new girls she was uh, telling everybody come on train and swim and now still from the old team there are girls that they are gone and now with Sophia they they really made a new good team and see what happened. It's paying effort. It's really nice for GB. Okay, at this moment, South Africa is having the puck. And they bring it to the left corner. One is trying to bring it to the inside. Now we go into the corner. Now turning, opening. Yes, there it goes. Pip flick swim. Come on, come on. Who's following up? A little Nobody. flick. Nobody. But see how slow, because yeah. this is turning and she's flicking. Yeah. This doesn't swim. It's also like like the, the, the GB ladies has much better control of the puck. Yeah. Maybe they had the opportunity to already train more with this puck than the South African ladies, because yeah, in South Africa they play with a different kind of puck. But, but you know. No, but if you see them turn, how to use at the pool yeah. anyway. Left. Yeah. So it's it's. I don't think it's a real. No, because you have a training session before, and when you come to a pool, Boy. when you come to a pool, then you say if you cannot flick with the puck, then you go into the water for one hour, and after one hour you can you flick. Can flick. And if if you cannot flick, then yeah, something is wrong with your equipment or whatever. But then you. Oh. Then you, you work. adjust it yeah. to, uh, to the tiles, to the puck, yeah. because uh, then you work I on think it. the GB had, uh, had uh, Italian pucks, but then they came here and the rubber is thicker than yeah. they had. So, and also yeah. maybe it's more sticky here on the bottom than it's in the pool in England. And the tiles can be of big, big importance uh, how the puck is reacting on, on, your, on your flick. Okay, let's see, here we go, South Africa, trying to open the yeah, game. That's good, that's good, but it's still halfway. Yeah. You don't push it through. No. No, but every time it's one on the puck, one behind, and there are only two South Africa girls are down. There are only two against three or four GB ladies. Yeah, you cannot win. They come in and yeah. they turn outside. Yeah, they never do the pick flip. The pick flip swim. They come from South Africa and they're not doing it. To bring it up and, the hole. And, 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 but and. Let's see, let's see. Go. No, save. And again, out. Brilliant. Here she comes again. See? Yeah. There's nobody there. No, nobody. No follow up from South African ladies. You have to swim. Yeah, the English, they just bring it to the corner. That's safe for them. 
and they wait, they wait. Still more than two minutes to go. What did you see? There are four ladies up from South Africa. How do you want to score? Come on, ladies. Do you want to score? Here we go, here we go. No following up. Flick it to the wall, yeah. Now we go. Why don't you do your flick swimming in? Yeah, it's a goal. A flick. Oh, very Aye. nice flick. Good high flick. What a score. Yeah, 6-2, but only two. Finally, finally, they start putting pressure. Yeah. And but yeah, it's only two minutes left, so I don't think that's enough time. They used to score every 30 seconds, but yeah, they swim back, and before they get started, it's already maybe one forty seconds left. Yep. Yeah, the GB ladies, they are much quicker. Awesome. The kickoff, that's much, much faster. Here they go. There they go, and... GB, and yeah, GB wins it. again. Amazing. And see how she can, how far she comes. She's almost like the five, five meter line. Nobody's blocking her. She can just swim through the middle. Nobody's blocking her. I'm very impressed about the GB. Yeah. Why? But also the workload they put in. You know, they all want to fight. They, they work like a team. When one goes up, you see the next one is already coming. And they're all working but for the park. they're coming in swimming. Yeah. So they're not waiting, they're coming in swimming. Yes, the Chardin, most of the Chardin But the men up. already won uh, beaten Turkey. Yeah. So there's something going up in England at the moment. Yeah, but well, last time GB was coming to uh, the Dutch Open uh, Championship with the GB team. And they were already playing a nice game. You really saw that something had changed in GB. Because also, also the GB men's team was playing very strongly on that tournament. Yeah. And uh, I was already wondering, well, if the, this team is going to continue like that, they're going to be a very, very strong opponent in the A-League again. For a couple of years they were not in the A-League and uh, yeah, in Sheffield they were there, but they couldn't be on the top. And then now they're really back on track. It's nice that they're doing the right thing again. Yeah. Yeah, GB is one of the three top uh, countries in Europe for playing hockey and uh, they, sh they should be there. And the last few years they were just only going down, going down. And now they come back. And another score. Yes, very nice. Oh, yeah. And that's 7 two. Number 8. Number 8. Number 8. That's Jane. Jane. Oh, hey, hey. It's so almost finished. It's time, finished. It's time. Congratulations. A great game from the GB. Yeah. The GB women, the gold medal for the Sinos uh, Games. Here in Slovenia, Klein. Very nice, very nice. World well done. World champion 2009. Wins. Wins. And look at their smile. Look at their smiles. Look at Janet. Janet is so happy. Finally, after all those years. Yeah, hear her scream. She is so happy. But of course, the, the South African team, they're disappointed. And uh, all also, they're going to uh, gonna cheer. Because they know there's still a lot of work to do for the Columbia Games. But let's see what they're going to bring out there. And here you oh, see the GB girls cheering. 